Hello everybody, this is Aaron here and today I'm gonna show you how to get Mental Grey for Maya 2016. Uh, if you see the earlier versions of Maya before 2016, you get the Mental Grey renderer default. But in Maya 2016, you don't get the Mental Grey renderer by default because it's not installed by default but if you look at the later versions of Maya like 2017 or 2018 you don't get mental ray instead you need to pay for mental ray renderer instead you get a Arnold default renderer uh, mental ray and Arnold both are high-end rendering softwares but if you are uh, if you want um, Arnold for Maya 2016 you need to pay but if you want uh, mental ray for Maya 2017 or 2018 you need to pay for the mental ray render so today I'm going to show you how to get mental ray for Maya 2016 first of all what you need to do is go to your favorite browser my favorite browser is Google Chrome and type google.com and go to the search bar and type download mental ray for Maya 2016 and go to the first link and I have written the link in the description so you can just click on the link I have clicked on it and you can see here's the download link mental ray plugin for Maya 2016 it's an sfx.exe file so I'm gonna click this and the download starts but I'm gonna cancel this because I have already downloaded it and saved it in my desktop in the folder called YouTube and I'm gonna open this this is not an installation file instead this is an extraction file it's a self extractor file so I'm gonna change okay yeah I'm gonna save it in the C drive as order desk folder okay and this takes up to approximately 10 seconds. Yeah, now it's done. And I'm going to run the exe. Yes, I want to start the exe. And preparing to install. Yeah, I'm going to click next. Uh, it is going to install me in the Meltal, uh, in the Autodesk Maya that 2016 directory it is not by default it's not gonna install it into your Maya 2016 directory instead it is gonna choose a default location and save it okay it is going to save it in the program files Autodesk folder install And this may take some time and I will pause this video and get back after the installation gets complete and I have finished installing so I'm gonna click finish and uh, we need to wait for a while and that's gone and I'm gonna open Maya 2016 now and this takes a while to load up so come on Maya so I'm gonna wait to two to three minutes approximately And I have opened Maya 2016 and this this is taking a while to load up. So come on Maya. Mm. Come on man. Ah it's loading up. So what I'm going to do is go and open the rendering settings and I'm going to choose mental ray but I don't have a mental ray renderer don't get panicked what you need to do and 
one more process that is go to your windows no oh, this is taking a while and settings and preferences go to your plugin manager and what you need to do is apply to all so that all the plugins are loaded this takes a while and press the auto load so that it gets auto loaded every time loaded auto load loaded auto load loaded you can see here this is the directory where a mental ray was installed so I have take loaded and I'm gonna take the auto load button and refresh load it and press close and now I'm going to my rendering settings go to the render using panel and you can see how uh, from now onwards you can you can render with mental ray renderer you can see here uh, yeah we have got a mental ray renderer right now and if you are having doubt like whether you are having a mental ray uh, material you can just go to your hyper shader yeah and you can see here in the materials panel you have got the mental ray and you can choose the mental ray rent materials and render your scenes and thank you for watching this video guys if you like this video please hit the thumbs up button if you don't like hit the thumbs down button and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.